Howdy everyone, it's me once again, the one and only Kilroden. And today, I'm going to be reviewing a western film because I have not reviewed a western movie in quite some time. So the one I'm going to be reviewing is the one titled yeah, This one folks. Figured I would do it, like I just mentioned a moment ago, I haven't reviewed a western film in quite some time. So I just figured I would just take this as an opportunity to do so. Yes, of course, it's going to be one of those low-budget, cheaply made films from the past. And yes, quite old. It's really old. But that's fine by me, because I tend to review a lot of these vintage movies anyway. So, yeah, here we go, I guess. So, okay. Well, anyway, of course, as usual, folks, I do have the top of the plot, so... Let's get into it, shall we? Here we go. So in this film, we get to see that there's this individual named Duncan and his daughter. Let's just say they support themselves by the daughter's gambling skills as a father. Oh, there is this really tough woman as the main character in this film. Hey, having a woman uh, in a Watching as lead character, what do you know? Well, let's just say that she's attracted to this young doctor in town, but has to pretty much deal with a worthless gunslinger who pretty much wants her at any cost. So it does definitely stop quite a few things at risk here, folks. Let's just say that. But yeah, folks, this movie does get pretty crazy in this movie, of course. Because why not? Yeah, there's this doctor. And yeah. He's going to be part of this. Story, of course. There's also this. This gunslinger. Who pretty much wants to pursue. What he wants to do. And wants to pay. Him a sort of amount of money. For the use of his medical. Practices. But there's also the doctor's daughter. Who vows to pay back. The money, of course. She gambles and loses to her ex-lover, so, yeah. They fight when they discover she... It's when she discovers that the debt has been marked, so it's been rigged, I guess you can say. So, let's just say that things begin to get crazier and more and more, more wired as the story continues. Because, well, we have to make it exciting some sort of way, I suppose, and... Yeah. There you have it, folks. I'm guessing they were trying to do something different with the formula of these Western films by having a woman being a part of the important cast of characters. Oh, yeah, okay. That seems uh, fine to me. Also, folks, it's on my it's been on my to-do list for quite some time. I mean, I don't I know technically this is like notebook but I'm kind of my to-do list anyway because there's a lot of movies I have to review on here folks all right then so yeah just thought I'd review this because like I said I don't re I feel like I don't review western films that often really I'm gonna be honest with you I feel like I don't anyway but yeah I can say that this one is definitely worth watching if you're somebody that's into this vintage style type of uh, western movies then this one is definitely for you there's a good amount of enjoyment to be had here folks it's definitely well edited and it definitely has the you know the traditional western element attached to it so it's just what except a woman's the main character and she's doing a lot of crazy stuff herself and that's fine so I can say that I like this one it's quite enjoyable so, whoever complains about the Western films being nothing but a sausage fest, well, have a look at this one, for example. It's not always the men as the main character, but, I mean, I'm not saying that's the only thing that makes the film good. I like the acting, it's pretty solid, I like the editing, like the pacing. I mean, yes, okay, it may not have the biggest budget in the world, but still, I like what we're trying to do, and it did it. Pretty well, too, I will say that. It's definitely one of those films I can say that it's 
worth watching. It really is. I, I liked it. I like what I like what they were trying to aim for here. It was released in the double pack features before, and also those multi packs as well. And also, also not only that, not just that one, but also other multi packs as well. So yeah, but the thing is that folks, this, it's also released on a single disc DVD as well. If you want to see it like that. And quite a few times actually, so yeah, it's been released on two DVD, single disc or otherwise, more than once, so just keep that in mind folks, so if you want to get your cans a copy, there's a good chance you, you will be able to find it. Pretty fast paced, and the story itself is actually pretty good as well, so yeah, I really did enjoy this movie folks, I really did. I do recommend it, because, like I say, if you're a fan of... Westerns, then I definitely recommend it. Even though this is more, this is one of the more obscured titles I'm talking about, but it seems more of a reason to talk about it, I guess. And also, you know, if you're just a film buff in general, I guess you're gonna check it out. It's not gonna hurt at all. So, yeah, that's cool. We put the way it was kind of the story and whatnot, so definitely a recommendation for me, folks. No, not a bad feature at all. Ah. Anyway, I'll give it an overall rating of a 7.2 out of 10. It gets a 7.2 out of 10 for me. And of course, as always, thanks for watching and take care. Until next time, see ya. Oh yeah.